Hey there everybody, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Disgaea 5 Complete. So, last time we left off we were, you know, trudging on through, uh, like go, see, where was it? I think it was, uh, here we go, Dark Testament. So, we had already beaten Bloodus here, we were trudging through here. So, let's go ahead and do that. for you to use this skill. Is that true? Yeah. Why do you ask? Because when I look at you, it seems like you have more of an innocent heart than I do. My heart is full of hatred and rage. It's impossible for me to perform a trick like this. But it doesn't really seem like that. Vengeance is the only thing that keeps me going. I can't let go of my anger and hate. And I don't intend to let go of it. That's why I'm relying on you. Huh? Sorokin, you have something that I don't. Your innocent heart and wanting to save Goldion will surely lead you to mastering this skill. Yeah, I get it, bro. I will complete it. I promise. And I'll save Goldion. I'll graduate from being a weakling coward to becoming a strong man. <laughs> Ever since we entered this enemy netherworld, you guys have done nothing but training and peeping. You sure have plenty of time. Hey, you gotta be ready. Training is the best way to get ready for enemy combat. Alright, let's see what we got. So, obviously, netherworld out of bounds is still going on. Toss somebody off the stage, that's it. A Lilim? Oh, these are Impusas. Oh, man. Oh, and they're clone stages. Ew. God, no. I need to get rid of that ASAP because I'm not dealing with that mess. Let's go. Putting as many throwing people as we can. Okay, so there's a few things that have changed. One, uh, obviously my knight is a lot stronger. So I did transmigrate uh, both, or actually three or four people the knight here my fighter here uh actually i think i did dracula as well yeah i did i definitely did dracula dracula is actually ridiculously strong right now and i actually found a perfect way of farming mana thanks to dracula now which is using dracula on a particular stage uh i'll post the information for the name of that stage on screen I'm not gonna go back to it and do it now but I know it's one of the Demonstrum stages but as long as I have him out on that particular stage I can pretty much get infinite mana because sweet lord do they give you a crap ton of enemies to fight and everything's on clone panels so to top it off give uh Dracula the extra mana uh, ability which I did do uh, I should have to show you what ability he has right now he has two other ones besides uh, the ripple status here we go abilities so ripple impact which lets him do damage to adjacent enemies which I also found out uh, if there's let's say he's here let's say my enemy was Kefla right I attack Kefla and Kakashi's here. I thought it would rip out just to Kakashi and then stop. But no, anyone that's touching Kakashi also takes damage. So if there's an enemy here and an enemy here, they take damage. If there's an enemy up here, 
that's touching this guy, he well, he takes damage. There's an enemy over here, they, they take damage. It is massive and it's great for taking out huge waves of enemies. So I'm really loving that effect, but I also gave him the other ability as you saw. What that does is it boosts his aptitudes uh, for HP, attack, and defense by 20%. So his offensive stats just skyrocketed. Uh, here we go. Yeah, HP, attack, and defense. Veteran hero, and then I give him the mana lover. Gives him increased uh, mana. But as you see, his aptitudes for HP, uh, 165. Attack and defense, 170. So he's almost getting double the actual value of whatever items I equip him on. Now, as for these nerds, uh, I need to get rid of those panels. I don't know where they are. Okay, there's one over there. Uh, where's the other one? Um, so there's one. Oh, they're in two different directions. Oh, crap baskets. Okay, that's a problem. Mm, so I have to throw you over here. I'll throw you back over there. I'll throw you over here. Oh wait, did I lower the? Oh, I just realized I didn't lower the levels. Let me go back and fix that. Yeah, I, I happen to remember as I was going through that. This is like the fourth time I've done that now in this let's play. I am absolutely terrible with that. I am so sorry. Let's put that back down to zero. All right, any other settings that need to be off? No. All right, we're good here. All right, let's try that again. Without getting myself rocked. Because I was about to just get destroyed by those impuses. Especially since they have clone on. Let's go back to the Valbin Spear. Skip. Thank you. Alright, but now that I know that they're in two separate directions. Alright, so I got one over here. And the other one's over that way. I might as well just let them clone then. There's no way I can stop both clones at the same time. Let's end this quick. Mm. To Might as well show off the damage that Dracula can do now. We're gonna end the turn there. Yeah, you can magic boost yourself, buddy. All right, there they go. So one strategy I could take to do this is just. Kill the impuses on their actual clone stand on their uh, clone stages or squares, whatever. Was it good for you? That's all. Yep, yep, yep. Keep using the fire. So impuses are basically just succubies. So this is just destroying them. Relatively easy. Let's see, can I hit you from here? Mm. Yes, I can, but you don't do enough damage for that. Can I lift you up? Nope. Alright, so he's got another square to go, I guess. I can't hit you from there. Target height problem, boulder crush. Yo yo trick. 18 up, 18 down, huh? Can I yo-yo trick from here? No, one square up. I can yo-yo trick, okay. So, you're gonna die. Horrifically. Yep, you can just keep magicking up them, that's fine. Yep, yep, yep. That is hilarious. Stop with the hip attacks. Wait, did you just kill Killia? Oh man, you killed Killia. That's a problem, actually. Hmm. Alright. You know what? We're gonna... Get rid of you real quick. I'm not letting you stand on there. You must be playing. Target height problem. Okay. 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 Hmm. I just lift you. I'm gonna just lift you. 
Bye bye. But I am not in the mood to deal with that garbage. Stop that. Oh man, there's so many of them. Jeez. Alright, you. Die for me. You too. Goodbye, goodbye. I'm okay with them all stacking up like that, because now, boom, everybody takes damage. Alright, now that you're dead, abuses are next. Going to Phantom Blow here. Yep, 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 that's adorable. Alright, perfect. Revenge, and you're dead. Great, two more. Why am I not surprised? Die and die. This would be another good stage for this to do, the trick that I was mentioning with the clones. Because obviously this stage isn't going to ever stop with their clones until you get back here to stop them. But with that in mind, you can get a whole crap ton of mana and EXP from this. I personally prefer the Demuntrum one only because you can get a lot more uh, mobs to spawn. Or not so much to spawn, but it's easier to control them in where they're going to be. I'm going to just do this because waiting for them to do their little thing is annoying. Plus you get to see off his unique skill, Lightning Sword. Oh, one of his unique skills anyway. Lovely 3x3 three three move. Massive damage. There we go. One less clone to worry about. Alright, you're dead. Actually, I've got a cheeky way of getting rid of that other clone panel. I could toss that onto a blue square over there and hit all the impuses at once. Alright, let me put that over there just to be safe. Make sure Drac doesn't kill them all. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, 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 yep. So I'm grab this. I want to throw this onto a blue square. Not a yellow square. Whatever. That is okay. Because now I just walk up. I lift and I throw. That takes care of that. That's my other side. There we go. Alright, that got rid of the other clone panel. Awesome. Now it's just killing the rest of you guys. Well, that's a good way to do that. Was it good for you? Now, because I don't feel like dealing with any of you guys, I'm just throw you off. Come on. Was it just me or was that shaking? Oh, they are shaking. That was weird. Mm. 
Hello. Goodbye. Alright, you two. I don't feel like dealing with you. Good night. Stage clear. That solves many problems. Oh, Priscilla surrendered. Awesome. Say it definitely suits you. Uh, I want to eat some curry flip. Are you okay with that? Letting them say whatever they want about you? Or was all that stuff about becoming strong like Goldion and saving him all just talk? No! I I'll complete the final skill, even if it kills me! I won't run away! I won't be a coward anymore! I will save Goldion! All right, well, he is just dead set on saving Goldion, so let's help him get there. So, Roken, think of this as your last opportunity. If you can't get a grasp on the final skill, then we need to give up on saving Goldion. Power is everything for demons! Red Magnus guesses it's impossible for a weakling like you to do the final skill. My, what a useless male. Just clean my shoes like the other primmies. I want curry for dinner, Flip. It looks like we have no choice. We must give up on saving Goldion and go with plan B. Isalia, what did the curry have anything to do with anything? What? I can't accept that. I'm going to save Goldion. And prove it. Release your innocent heart that wants to save Goldion with all your might. I... I'll do it! I'll do it! I won't run away anymore, no matter how scary it is. I will save Goldion this time. Out of bounds is active. Ally boost plus 50. What? what I'm gonna just take this first and pop that right over there. There's an Impisa up there, I see her. I'm gonna throw that on that warp panel real quick, let it warp away. Or it's not. Okay. Oh wait, is it that I have to warp somebody away first and then put it on here? That'd be annoying. If that's the case, I'm using Dracula. I don't know about everybody else yet. Dracula's strong enough to actually battle everybody without having to be healed too often. Plus he has his own heal anyway. Pop Dracula on there and end the turn. There he goes. Where'd you go now, Dracky? Oh, some treasure chests up there, huh? Gotta make sure I don't kill everybody first. Alright, so Drac has made it onto the other ship. There's a green warp over there. Hmm, how am I gonna do this? I could just wild crescent. Here we go. Bye. Come on. Now Dracula warps over to a green panel. 
Okay, so now we're on the green ship. Or on the blue ship, I should say. Now, do I have anything that actually does... Elemental, yes. Alright, now I work away again. What? What did I just do? Another world in my pocket. Another world has become none. What? Did I accidentally hit? Uh, I think I accidentally hit. Yep. Current Nether world. Ah, oh, bollocks. I accidentally summoned this Nether world, Blood Parch. So that got rid of the over the overworld effect here. What's one of the empty ones? Suck a port around. Purple. Alright, just end the turn here. Teleport away from y'all. Bye. No, stop checking the netherworld. It took away a whole bonus gauge from me, so that sucks. Alright, Dracula is now over here. How do I get to the other side? There's the purple. If I could just figure out where in the world this camera angle is, thank you. Come on. I'm gonna take that purple warp. That's a yep, you can fire all day long. I'm gonna take this over to the secret little area up here. Grab all these treasure chests while I'm at it. Ooh. Princely curry and Medal of Greed. Just had to make sure I didn't destroy those colors because I need those to warp around back to where I was. There we go. Alright, so now that I'm back on this side of town. Let's go ahead and delete these guys off of the face of the earth. Bye bye. Was it Alright, now let's keep chasing them around. What? Oh you charmed me. Oh I can't even do anything. Alright, enough with the hip attacks. Die. Thank you. Might as well take some of my health back while I'm at it. Vital steel, out of range. Yo yo trick isn't though. There we go. Yep, yep, yep. Keep doing it. You guys are about to get absolutely molly -whopped. I am so sorry for your fate. I wonder if I can get multiple health from this. Because I get healed for each little bit of damage I do. Oh, nope. Just for the main skill. Okay. You're dead. And that's it. Stage is clear. Ooh, four characters surrendered. Nice. Oh, is he doing it? A tiny little one, but he did it. The Avidja Holy Water. Bro, bro. Was that? This is... Zerokin grasped a hint of the final skill. Looks like we're all ready now. It's time for the real deal. Zorokin is carrying another world within him. <laughs> you did it, Zero. I'm impressed. You're not a weakling anymore. Old Man Magnus. Don't call Red Magnus an old man. He's younger than he looks. Zorokin, who now carries another world within him, has become an overlord. Congratulate you for mastering the final skill. I'll let you become one of my servants. 
<laughs> Seraphina Sis. Don't call me Sis. You shall address me as Madam Seraphina. Zerokin has learned the Overload skill, Superluminal Wolf. You did it, Zerokin! Tonight we're having curry play! Usalia, we have curry every night. Ooh. Unbelievable. It appears we can proceed with our plan after all. Usalia, Christo, Bro, and everyone else. Did you guys all purposely say harsh things to me so that I could bring out my power? Mm-hmm. Casually look about. away. <laughs> so this is what it's like to have allies. You, you idiot! Men don't cry. <laughs> and now I have another loyal servant. We're counting on you, Zerokin. Whether or not the rebel army will be able to recruit the great demon fist Goldion is entirely up to you. Christo, we're not recruiting him, we're saving him, Blitz. All right, nice. So before I go in, might as well Let's heal up, fix you up, check out some of these events. What kind of person is the legendary <laughs> the legendary great demon Fiskoldion, Plip? I would like to know if he's qualified to become my servant. If it's information about Master, then leave it to me. I'll tell you everything. If you want to tell us about Goldion, you should start with tales of heroism. Right, then I'll tell you about the best stories I know of Goldion's legend. Hearing a heroic tale about the person we are going to fight will be just depressing. Hmm, that's true, Flip. Then, what do you want to know? What doesn't he like or his flaws? Does he have any of those? Anything besides his old scar? Heh, <laughs> Master's a perfectionist. He doesn't have any flaws. No, not quite. What's up, Kilia? Does the legendary Greek Demon Fist have flaws? Goldion's flaws, he's a restless sleeper. Restless sleeper? Plip? Yeah, if you sleep in the same room, he'll put you in a hold in his sleep. I've had countless bad experiences with this. D damn. Master. Wait, no. D damn, Master. He doesn't even show any mercy in his sleep. If we're able to recruit him into the rebel army, he'll be sleeping with you. What? What? Wait! Come on, sis! <laughs> isn't it isn't that like a dream come true to be since you'll be with your master 24-7? Man, I can't read today. The great demon fist Goldion has a surprisingly cute side plip. Alright, nice. So, uh just casual afterthought because I just realized he was saying bro and sis and old man. It might be a thing, like, like go, it might not translate as well in English, but I know in Japan, um, the whole Yakuza thing, male members would call their seniors bro. Now, it could be that his character archetype was based off of Yakuza. I don't know. I'd have to look into it, but it's definitely a possibility. Or he's just genuinely calling them bro and sis, so it'd be Onechan, Onichan, stuff like that. But if he's a Yakuza, he'd be saying Aniki. So I'd have to look into that. Look at you, Zerokin. I'm graduating from being a weakling coward today. I'll save Goldion this time. All right, let's whop on Goldion here. Ain't gonna be like the first time, buddy. I'm busting out the big boys. Ha! 
Need Altair here. Mm, excuse me. End that turn. Wow, you went straight for them. All right, I see how it is. Ooh, nice, nice, nice. Yeah, that's the case. I'll surround you, buddy. I don't have a problem with that. Arg. I'm gonna need. Where are you, Logan? Did I just like scroll past you? Yeah. That's fine. I just need to lift you and throw you there. There we go. Gonna just wild crescent. Mm. Don't want a purgatory foam, so I'll just regular attack with you. Regular attack here. Galahad shield to protect everybody else. Boom. There we go. Getting in some good damage with Logan as well. Nice, nice. Oof. And she's guarding. Alright, so now he has weakened defenses. Last. Now that I got that going on, what I'm gonna do is. Make a nice long chain of gunners. I think that is every single gunner I have. Oh, wait, no. Phantom. Almost forgot about you, buddy. And everybody's gonna use their single target skills. Do you have any items we're stealing, actually? Cross counter, chainmail, falcon shoes, nothing. So, that's the case. We're just gonna keep shooting you up, alright? One, two, three, four. Nice. Ooh, that Dark Rosario. Alright. Let's see. He has a whopping 15 grand of health left. So, we're gonna do as much damage. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. Not in that order. There we go. We're gonna do as much damage as we possibly can. This ought to do almost all his whole health bar. <coughs> Deliciousness with that wild crescent there. Ooh, Logan. Combo. I'll take it. Didn't I tell you to use Galahad's shield and not another trailer attack? I could be wrong. Oof. Almost. Alright, so he's got one more turn left and then he's down. It's gonna be Dracula that finishes him off. Goodbye. And that was it. That was relatively easy. Is that all the power? No. 
All the feelings you have toward Goldion? Don't give up. Release your innocent heart to save Goldion. Is he dead? Yes! We did it, Flip! Kilia! Sorokin! What the? What's with that super dark energy? That hideous miasma! That must be the power Void Dark was using to control him! What an evil energy! I've never seen anything so evil! At least now he isn't being brainwashed anymore. <laughs> Why are you still alive? I thought I killed you. me you actually do know right that i can kill void dark in an instant i don't care what happens this guy i'll kill him with my very own hands after an intense battle sir kilia defeats void dark what? Red Magnus was planning on defeating Void Dark, but Kilia super cut in line ahead of me! But the battle doesn't end there. More powerful enemies stand in Sir Kilia's way. <laughs> Looks like Void Dark fell. But he was the weakest of the Elite Four. I, Shadow Dark, shall face you next. <laughs> the Elite Dark? <laughs> what? The Elite Four, Jesus Christ. Say what? Seventeen more Void Darks. Oh boy. We're gonna save here and keep going. Stop time for you forever with your own skill, which you used to narcissistically love so much. <laughs> you bastard. I'll kill you once again. Shut up. You. I'll. <laughs> no, you won't. You can't defeat me. What? Know where you stand. Sir Kilia! Bro! This is terrible. His ribs are broken. He might have internal... N no! He's in no condition to fight. We have to retreat. Strongest overlord! 
way, Master. The final skill was perfect. <laughs> Powerless and unintelligent overlords. Why don't you all come at me? I'll take you all down on my way to killing Kilia. I'm sorry to interrupt you while you're having fun, Lord Lord Dark Pool. Who are you? Does he have another I'm one? I'm here on behalf of my predecessor, who was executed the other day. I, Baron Imp, shall serve as your 87th secretary, Pooh. Oh my Great god. News, Pooh. Ah, you've got quite a bit of nerve. If this news isn't great, I'll murder your entire species. Alright. Thanks, Void Dark, with that genocidal maniac What's routine. Hurry up and spill it. Capture Squad has reported that they have found the Overlord who possesses the Overlord skill you've been looking for, Pooh. <laughs> I see. That is great news. <laughs> you guys are very lucky. I'm in a great mood today. Rejoice. I'll kill you all instantly. Don't underestimate us! Who in the red hell do you think you're standing face to face with? I don't know. The weak don't interest me. You... Are you calling the Overlord of Scorching Flame weak? Please wait, Lord Void Dark. You don't have to face these weaklings yourself. <laughs> do you have any right to say that? Given that you were having trouble taking care of them. I don't have anything to say to that. But you have finally found the overload skill that can absorb energy. That should be your top priority. An overload skill that absorbs energy? Fine. This is just a minor event before a historic one. There should be no problem with abandoning this garbage. Let's go, Bloodis. Yes, my lord. You are spared again, Kilia. The next time we meet, I will kill you. <laughs> hey! Jabroni! Red Magnus, we do not have time for this, buddy. Time to be thinking. Oh, saved! Just because Void Dark left. Hurry up and take Sir Kilia to my pocket netherworld. Huh? D don't be ridiculous. Crap! I super ruined my only shot. Void Dark already has that much power, but he's still trying to obtain an overload skill that has the ability to absorb energy. We may have avoided the worst case scenario. But I have a very bad feeling about this. Episode 9, The New Power. Impossible. I can't even land a hit. What's going on? If I may say, your fists are unrefined. Remember. You cannot defeat me with a fist that only seeks to overpower its enemy. Shut up! I can do more than this! Don't move! I'll knock that confident look right off your face! Don't bother bluffing. I've foreseen all your moves. I acknowledge your courage, but I doubt you even have the strength to stand. Not yet. I haven't lost yet. I am Kalidia from Cryobud! I'm the strongest overlord! <laughs> uh, I see you withstood it. I thought you were just some reckless kid. But you've got guts. Kilidia was it. It's true that you have great potential. Extraordinary potential, actually. But you're not using your power correctly. That is why you lost to me. I 
haven't lost yet. Do you want to defeat me? Do you want to become stronger? Of course I do. I want the strength to nail my fist into your face. All right, then come with me. And then you shall master the technique that defeated you. What did you say? Are you a fool? Don't toy with me! Void, Lise, I'm back. Welcome back, Father. You have been gone for quite a while, so I was starting to worry. That's why I told you I'd go instead. You were probably just trying to convert another enemy or something. You're too soft, Pops. If I were you, I'd take them all out with one hit. You're talking big, as always, I see. It'd be nice if you could master the ultimate demon technique final skill like that. <laughs> Giving me another lecture? I'm tired of hearing all that heart nonsense. Hmm? Father, behind you. Oh, right. Lise, please take care of him. You went too far again! Where did you pick up this piece of garbage? His name is Kilidia. I've decided to teach him the ultimate demon technique. Void, he will soon become your apprentice brother. Look after him. What? You're gonna teach him the ultimate demon technique? H have you gone mad, Pops? I have made my decision. Plus, it'll be great training for you, too. This is stupid. Don't tell me it'll train my heart. I won't accept this. Boy, that's enough. Stay out of this, sis. I am the one who's going to inherit the ultimate demon technique. You too, Father. You can't make such important decisions by yourself. Boy's anger is completely understandable. I'm sorry, Lisa, but this is what's best for him. Boys will be boys. But in that case, there is one problem for you to deal with, Father. Oh, and what is that? Today's dinner. I only prepared a meal for three. Hmm. Uh. Hey, don't move. Wait a second. I'll tend to your wounds. <laughs> if your father's apprentice, then that means we're family from now on. Where is... You're okay. I mean, I'm relieved because I won't be losing my top servant. No one said anything. Sure thing, Sarah. Sure thing. I see. Blood has took me down. Bro! I always believed you'd make it through. Says the man who was crying and digging a grave out back with Red Magnus. Hey, Christo! You didn't have to bring that up! So, what happened after that? Nothing! Boy Dark and Blood is just left split. Without finishing me off? I would like to ask you about that, but first... Kilia, how are you feeling? Yeah, don't worry. This will heal in no time. Alright, the Innocent Aid Squad has been unlocked. Squad training. Or skill training. Kelia and friends can now use combo skills. Oh boy. I unlocked a, lot of, a whole lot of things. Let's go see what's up first. Uh, awesome. Squads. Innocent aid. Oh, enhances the innocent farm. Okay, well, we drop off uh, another penny. What does that do? Go ahead and enjoy. Key innocence will be waiting for you. Innocent farm. Oh, is this the thing that I was reading about earlier? Yeah, I could trade and breed innocence here. 
you want to store innocence they will grow innocence take time to grow so you go to a battle if you start innocence long enough you'll get strong innocence but the growth of innocence will end they can't grow indefinitely how much they can grow set at birth when you see they reach their limit they'll see the star symbol for innocence stop growing be sure to switch them out reading Mm-hmm. All right, so we're gonna put in some of these innocents in here Like the gladiator And if I can do I have more statisticians I should I saw the broker in there not what I'm looking for. I want to put statisticians in there. I've got to have another statistician. There's no way I don't have one. Alright, there's one. Oh, wait. When there's a star next to their name, they can't grow anymore. Oh, okay, okay. Hold on. That's the case. I'm gonna go take the statistician that's over here. I don't know who has it right now. Or does nobody have it? So nobody has it right now. That's the case. I'm gonna go grab the statistician from in here. Plop you in, deliver. There it is. If I'm lucky, they should breed and give me another one. Overload skill, super luminal wolf. How's that? Can you keep up with my speed? <laughs> A guy that wasn't an overlord until just recently shouldn't be talking so big. Overlord skill, Super Olympia! Please stop fighting, Plip! You guys, what happened here? Zero said his Overlord skill is super strong, than the, wait, super stronger than the Supreme ones, so Red Magnus thought he should fight him. How childish of you to want to use the skill you just learned. Shut up! I'm gonna prove that my overload is the strongest! Zerokin, stop. Sir Kilia, it's quicker to take care of men who don't understand with your words like this. Overload skill, Baylor Gaze! Madam Serafina, hooray! Madam Serafina, hooray! Madam Serafina, super hooray! Madam Serafina, super hooray! The strongest overload skill is my Baylor gaze, of course. Hmm. Turn them back to normal in a little while. You're going to leave them like that for a little while? <laughs> Poor guys. We're going to save here. Where would you like to go, dude? Let's see what's going on. Test this new skill to see if it meets my expectations. All right, I'll find a demon. We don't have time for that. Lord Void Dark? Help me. 
Well, guess it's time to get number 88. This is it. This is the skill I've been searching for. Not gonna lie, that pose is super freaking cool. Magnus is all ready to go. He can't wait to get super rowdy. By the way, Sir Kilia, what are you eating this time? Netherworld pork with the tropical ghost wax gourd, stewed in a special roux for 120 hours. I call it special Netherworld curry stew. I mix the butter base roux with 64 spices into the zombie broth. It's great for when you're tired. People do say that you can't fight on an empty stomach, but I'm surprised that you can eat after that battle. Plus, zombie broth? Well, even so, my bro's food is always delicious. Usalia, you should eat some too. I held back on the spiciness. Thank you very much. I'll gladly have some flip. Kilia, I want to ask you something. Something that Void Dark said sounded disturbing. He said that he had taken your overload skill, Alma Ice Sculpture, and Void Dark knew who you were. Care to explain what's going on? Let's see. I've never told anyone this before, but I can tell you guys. Void Dark and I were taught the ultimate demon technique together. Uh, are you serious? Then, is Void Dark also one of Goldion's apprentices? He's more than just his apprentice. Void Dark is Goldion's actual son. Yup. What? But that means Void Dark brainwashed his own father and turned him into a demon general. That's right. But that's nothing new. It's just part of his nature. My overload skill, Alma Ice Sculpture, was stolen. It took everything from me. He stole your overload skill? No way! Is that even possible? The Overload skill, Brigante Eclipse, it's the ability to take an opponent's Overload skill and make it your own. That's the absolute worst ability. It seems fitting for Void Dark. By the way, what kind of ability did Alma Ice Sculpture have, Sir Kilia? Nullifying other Overload skills, perhaps? Hey now, sis. And everyone else, for that matter. Don't you think you're all asking too many questions? I have a right to know everything about Sir Kilia. If you are going to interfere, then I shall have to force you to become my servant, using my overload skill. Y you can't threaten me! I'm not a weakling anymore! No, it's okay, Zoroken. We'll be facing him in the future, so I should let you all know about the Alma Ice Sculpture. It can instantly freeze time around the target. Does that mean it stops the flow of time for the opponent? Like that exists? That's far more powerful. Not quite. To stop time around a living organism would continuously require an enormous amount of energy. It's not a combat friendly ability. In fact, it actually isn't well suited for combat at all. You're wrong. This is really bad. What do you mean? Killian. While you were unconscious, I heard Void Dark had captured an Overlord who has an Overload ability to absorb energy. With Ice Sculpture and the ability to absorb energy, if he uses both Overloads, he can stop time forever. An ultimate Overload combo! Uh, Red Magnus is super at the corner of Piss Me Off Boulevard and Envious Drive! <laughs> <laughs> already started. We can't just let this slide. Hey, Kilia, are you saying that we have to postpone taking our fight straight to Void Dark? 
Netherworlds that lose their magical power end up as space dust, and so do the demons who live there. I can't let that happen. But that won't be a problem once we lay it the Kraken down on Boy Dark. Dude. Are you okay with taking that risk? It appears that one of the spheres hit a netherworld that you are very familiar with. Ugh. What are you talking about? Stop beating around the bush and tell Red Magnus straight up. Using my clairvoyance, I have confirmed that the netherworld that is currently the most in danger is the very one you rule. Scorching Flame. Oh, sounds like we're going to Scorching Flame then, guys. Yes. Alright, that's good to know. But we will save that for next time. So, I'm going to save right here. I know we didn't get to do a lot of uh, actual, you know maps and stuff like that we only technically went through like two or three and we just got cut up with a million cutscenes but we will see what happens here in you know uh scorching flame and red magnus finally returning home we'll see that next time on let's play this guy if i've complete so here's your motivational quote for the day guys the two most important days in your life are the day you are born and the day you find out why Mark Twain. So, if you liked today's episode, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you really like my content, go ahead and hit the subscribe button, hit that notification bell. That way, you're always up to date with whenever I post a new episode. If you didn't like the episode, go ahead and give it a thumbs down. And in either case, drop in a comment. Let me know what you think I could be doing better. And let me know just what you feel about the game itself. If you haven't already done so, go ahead and check out my Facebook page. It'll be in the description below. You can actually comment a name and a class, and if I like the name with that class, I'll go ahead and make your class into an actual character in game and use them. So, with that in mind, I will be seeing you here next time on Let's Play This Guy of Five Complete, where we find out what's going on on Scorching Flame. Hope to see you all there. This is Afrolet signing out. I hope you all have a great day.